This is the only place you need to go if you need cheap and fast coins to build your God Squad. Hands down, they have the cheapest prices. Make sure you go to MMOXP.com and use code WOLF for 5% off. Link is in the description. In today's video, I'm going to show you guys easy money plays that you can run. We'll focus on the zone, then we'll focus on mad defense in the next video from the same formation and set. Before we get into today's video, drop kick the like button, subscribe if you're new, turn notifications on, bro. Become a member of the Wolfpack. Link is in the description. Now we're going to be back in the Packers playbook, man. People, it was a unanimous decision. People wanted more plays from the Packers. So, okay, let's let's just do it. We're going to be I-form slot. Now, this one has some pretty good run plays. It's got stretch. It's got toss. However, I don't really run toss. If I'm going to do anything that goes outside to the right, it's going to be stretch. And then you have uh, the halfback dive alert bubble. You have that as well. Uh, and then you have halfback blast. These are good run plays, bro. Typically, you're going to be running I-form in the red zone right but you can actually bring it you can bring it on the field bro so this play right here pa switch curl from the packers playbook i mean it's pretty much 100 percent against cover three the only way they're gonna be able to stop it is to user it okay or man up the route but you're not gonna just be spamming this play so don't spam it against any cover three in a game just make sure you're on the left hash now you can run the play stock you, you'll notice it hopefully i don't get insta set it you can run the play stock right here, but people are too close to him. Okay, we don't want that. What we want to do is we want to force separation with this play. So how are we going to do that? We're going to put A on an out route. That's all we need to do in this play. All right, taking you guys to the promised land. All right, just you'll see the separation now. Boom, defense is separate. I get insta shedded, but I still get the pass off now. Do you need to keep play action? No, hell no. I don't even like play action, bro, but I'm just leaving it in here to see how many times I get shedded. So you guys can laugh at me. So right here, boom. You can. I wouldn't lowball that, bro, because if they put a spy and like you're throwing into that vicinity and the spy is there, he could probably pick it off, bro. Okay, so just throw that regular. He's gonna sit really nice inside cover three. Okay, simple as that, and the play works really good against all of them. Okay, don't make any other adjustments. Just leave it the way it is. Put A on an out route and just follow my lead. You'll see that this guy's always gonna be open. Now this isn't glitchy. I haven't. Matter of fact, I hadn't even tried to see if the glitch works on this one. Let me go ahead and streak A. Let's see if we can get the glitch to work here with the smoke screen and X. I doubt it, and I'm probably going to get insta shed at trying this. I mean, it, yeah, I guess it does. I guess it does work, bro. <laughs> I guess it does. Let's try that again, man. This is going to be glitchy. Oh, man, the glitches in this game are just insane. Let's just do this again. I'm going to streak A, smoke screen B, streak X. Pretty much how we're going to run the play. Let's just see if we get this consistently. Hopefully, I don't get insta shed it. There it goes. Oh, yeah. This is going to be glitchy, homies. It's a it's glitch. Okay, it's a glitch play. We're going to turn this into a glitch touchdown because it's working. So you saw that right there. Now, what's cool about this play is it works against cover four drop the same way or any cover four where they make adjustments and changing their scene flats, purples, whatever. As long as they're putting them in like purples or clouds, it's going to work. But if they're running cover four quarters and they're not making those adjustments, it's not really going to work for you. So let's just pick cover four drops so you guys can see. I don't know what I'm doing, bro. Okay, my bad. I don't know what that is. Okay, so I guess because I'm using a, I don't know, another controller. Okay, so cover four, cover four drop right here. And all you're going to do is you just do the same thing. Put A on an out route right here. And you'll notice that X is going to just sit underneath everything. Okay, so show you one more time just put an hour against cover four drop and against cover three defense okay you can do that as well check this out boom money okay that's money all right so the next play that we're going to talk about uh for cover four quarters is going to be this one this one's really good against cover four quarters if you make the adjustments that i showed you it's the pa post shot now this play works against cover four drop as well and it works against cover two defense so this one's really good. It also works against cover two, man. If you, as long as you have the receivers to back it up, it's going to work. So cover four quarters, all you're going to want to do for cover four quarters, you're going to put A on a curl, B on a curl, okay? Now you can cancel play action. I'm just leaving it on in, in here on the video. Now I have Adams on the left side. He's already an X factor. I'm, I don't really care about all that. As long as he gets the separation, cover four quarters, you can one play TD this right over the top of their heads, bro. It's that simple. Okay, let me show you guys again. Okay, and then we'll move on the cover four drop variation. And then I want to say that it's going to be the same for cover four drop as well. 
You'll notice I get that separation. Just make sure you have your fastest wide receiver in that spot, possibly with route technician. I think Adams does have the route technician, so we good on that side, right? All right, this play against cover four drop. All you, all you really want to do, I say you could leave double curls, but I wouldn't. I would actually put a streak there, bro. I'll show you what I mean. Let me show you real quick. Give you guys the tips and techniques. So A is going to go on a curl, but B is going to go on a streak. Reason for that is so that safety does not follow him. Here I come over here to the right. You'll see I got the separation I need now. Another one play tutty. You see that? That's why we put the streak over there, because let me show you what happens if you don't. If you don't put the streak, you put double curls like we did cover four quarters. And what's going to happen is you're going to have that guy be able to follow him. You see now he's in position to make a play. We don't want that. We want to take him out of the equation to make it easy for us to score the tutty. So curl on one side, streak on. And yes, you need the curl. Okay, trust me. You need the curl. So here's the separation I need here. Now he's nowhere around me. And you guys just know how we roll on this side of Tizown. Now to run it against cover two, you're going to need to motion out the tight end, put him on a comeback route. Let me show you what I mean, okay? So same thing for those that know, okay? Just ho hold your horses, all right? Don't give it away. Let me show them, all right? Bring him out, put him on a comeback route, take B out of the equation. Probably just put him on a smart route, in route like this. This would probably be the setup. As long as I don't get insta-shedded, you throw this over the right, and it's another tutty. You see what I'm saying? So motion him out, put B on, a, uh, on an in route, and if you do get... If you don't want to keep play action, just cancel it, bro. Okay, I'm just leaving it in here on purpose, trying to see how many times I actually get shedded. I'm actually surprised I'm not getting shedded crazy right now, bro. Again, same thing. You'll notice that we get the leverage we need. Simple. And this is Adams because people on the last video, uh, of course, you're using the Chiefs, bro. They, they ignored the past four videos where I used the Packers showing the, the glitchy plays. They waited till I used the Chiefs again to show you one other play. And they said, oh, it's because you're using the cheat, bro. No, I'm the money play master, bro. Watch your mouth, bro. What are you doing, man? Somebody stick up for me, bro. Tell them something, man. Don't just let them get away with it. Simple and easy. Mid read cannot follow in man defense. They're going to have to put a middle blue. But if they do put a middle blue, you got the in route right underneath the whole thing. You don't even need to throw the one play tutty. It's just money for days. And if it does become a factor, right, then you just put Y on a curl route. So let's say you do this. Let's just assume. Okay, let's just assume. We motion him out. We put Y on the curl route, okay? You can block B if you want. That way, if he does have a mid blue, then boom, guess what? Boom, running back all day. And this is Jones. You guys know the speed of Jones. My man's going to get to where he needs to be fast, okay? And it gets covered two man, same way. It's just a little bit more tricky because you're going to have to have speed, man. All right? Don't be trying to run this with bums, bro. I can't vouch for it if you're running it with bums. All right, it's, it's, I just can't. You're going to set it up the same way as cover two defense. Maybe, right, maybe you put a drag on there. Maybe. Let's go ahead and put RB on a curl this time. Cancel play action. Okay, so we're going to have to leave the drag there. And I still get the separation I need because I'm using wide receivers that have the ability as a route technician to get open. So you can still do it. It's just going to be a little bit more difficult. You really, when someone wants to clamp you down in mad defense, you're going to have to get them out of it by running motion drags and stuff like that, bro. Motion slants, things like that. Make them to where they don't want to run mad defense. Don't just give them the benefit, man. Okay, just make them pay in those defenses. So that's what I wanted to show you guys, man. I'll probably go over a couple more uh, in this formation, but it's primarily you want to run with this. You can run the cover three glitch out of it. You got the 9-4 wheel. I don't know how good this is, bro. I'm just going to test it real quick. Let's just see. Nah, I don't like it, bro. This one, I don't know what it's good for. Can someone explain to me the 9-4 wheel and what it's good for? Is it good against double leg gap? Ooh, okay, so we found something it's good, good at. So if someone's running double leg gap on you, then you hit them with that play. So that defense right there will crumble. Other defenses, not so much. You see this run, a linebacker coming in? Like I said, there's certain run plays that are just good against one defense. There's run plays that's good against all of them. So there it is, man. Make sure you drop a like. Love you guys, man. Peace.